Good morning, sweetie pie. You're not on your blanket today. What are you doing? You're so beautiful. Oh, you don't like the camera, do you? No, you don't. You like when your mommy rubs you, though, huh? You like that, don't you? Look at your little ears. Look at your ears. Good morning. So, this morning, little Nolly and I went on a little walk. She's so tired. Come here. She's so tired right now. We went on about a 45 minute little trek around the neighborhood, which was good. It's a little bit more gloomy out now, and I guess this weekend is supposed to be like really cold again and we might get snow, which is just crazy. I mean, it was in the 70s last weekend, and now it's supposed to be like 38 this weekend, this upcoming weekend, so that's a lot of fun. But I got that done. I just finished my kale shake. Uh, I've really been liking it a lot more. I don't know, that first day, I think maybe I just didn't put enough stevia. I've been putting like 10 drops in now, and I think it's perfect. It's like not too bitter or anything. It's just water, kale, and stevia, and I really like that. So I finished that. I need to get some emails done. Uh, we have some real estate stuff happening, which is awesome, but I need to get that done like ASAP. So I'm gonna do that. It'll probably take an hour, maybe a little bit longer. I have to make a phone call. And then I'm hoping after my work is done, I can make this cauliflower rice sushi, which I'm really excited about. I've been looking up recipes for it and stuff, and so I'm kind of gonna do my own spin on it and just use the stuff that I already have. But I think, um, I don't know. I'm gonna probably just take a couple of things from each of the recipes that I've looked at. But I just found my recipes on Pinterest, I mean, you can do whatever you think is best. If you know how to make regular sushi, like just with regular rice, and you just want to do it exactly the way you do it, but use cauliflower rice instead, you can do that. But yeah, I'll try to show you guys as much as I can as I'm doing it, and I'll try to um, get you guys some recipes too. I'll link them below for you. But yeah, so that's my plan for the next couple of hours. I have to get this work done though. I know it's like one of those boring, this is my life day, like that's just how it is, you know? Work, a lot of the times it's work from home. Uh, Alex is at work. I actually just talked to him on the phone. He was telling me some stuff, but he's on his way there right now. So he'll be there only till six today, which is awesome. So we'll be able to hang out tonight. But yeah, for now, I just got to get this stuff done. And then when I'm making my cauliflower rice sushi, I will show you guys. Okay, I got my emails done, and now I need to make myself some coffee and hop on this conference call. That's probably gonna take longer than, than I expect because that's how it always is. I'm going to do a cinnamon dolce uh, coffee today. I'm gonna do it in the Keurig, although I've been really loving the Ninja. I think the Ninja is awesome. So that is what I'm gonna do now. Ooh, and then hop on this call. So I'm getting ready to make this cauliflower sushi. So this is gonna be the rice. I put a little bit of rice vinegar in it and I'm also going to add a tablespoon or two of cream cheese to it uh, once it cools down a little bit. But I just use the Green Giant Fresh uh, crumbles. This is the seaweed that I bought. I got this just directly from Amazon. And I've actually had it for a while because I wanted to make it for a while, but it's good till 2018, so that's good. Then I got this little bamboo pad to roll it, and I also got that from Amazon, and then these tools came with it as well. So I'm going to get everything laid out, hopefully the avocado is ready, and then I'll just show you guys how I'm making it. The avocado could probably be a little bit softer, but I think it's soft enough for this. Like, I'm going to cut it up and hopefully it tastes okay. I'm sure it will. And here it is. It's so good. I just tried a piece because it kind of fell apart, but it's so good. I'm going to add some coconut aminos to it, and this will be my lunch today. I'm really excited about it. I have never tried cauliflower rice sushi before, but I've seen so many things about it, so 
I'm just so excited that it worked out and you can really add anything you want in there. But I'll try to type up like a recipe or something or at least tell you guys the things I used in the bottom bar so you can try it at home if you want to. I cannot get over how good that sushi was, you guys. It was so delicious. Like, I loved it. And I I kind of struggled with the roll. I won't, I won't lie to you on that. Like, rolling it, I wasn't the greatest at. You definitely have to have like, what is it called? Like a, you know like a bread knife that has the little ridges on it? What do you call that? I know there's a word for it, I can't think of it right now. But you need that type of knife to cut it because I was trying to cut it with a normal knife and that wasn't working. So uh, you definitely need like a ridged knife like that. What is it called? You guys know what it's called, I can't think of it. Um, but you need that to cut it. It was easy to cut through. You can easily use like salmon if you wanted to use that. You could just use vegetables if you wanted. You don't have to put any meat in it or any fish. Um, you could just do, like you could actually use like coconut cream or coconut milk instead of the cream cheese if you wanted to make it like a Whole30 version. I personally think the only thing that I didn't love was the rice vinegar. Um, I've never really used rice vinegar before and I know that that's, I think that's what they use to make like sticky rice, you know, in sushi. But I don't know, I think maybe I used a little bit too much. I mean, I used a tablespoon for the whole bag of cauliflower, but I just didn't love the taste. And then I looked at it, I didn't even think much about the vinegar, like I was like, oh, it's, you know, it's low carb, low sugar. It had like five carbs and three or four sugars per tablespoon. So. I don't know. I think I could definitely use like an apple cider vinegar for sure instead of that and it would be just as good. So that's probably what I'll do next time. Uh, I probably will do salmon instead of crab next time. But yeah, all in all, it was really good. The avocado was fine. It wasn't like extremely ripe yet, but it was good enough. It tasted really good. And then I just kind of like cut up some cucumbers and put that in there. So I was into it though. It took a little, it took a while to get it all together. That's why I didn't film much because I was like trying to focus on the roll and getting everything in there right. So yeah, but I highly recommend it. I will link some recipes below. I'll do like a salmon version of it. I will put a crab version. I'll put a veggie version and then I'll do like a, I'll see if I can find like a Whole30 version as well. Cause I'm sure that you can do, do it like a Whole30 way with, with coconut cream. I don't see why you couldn't do that. So I'll link a bunch of things below for you guys, but I highly recommend trying it. I think Alex is actually going to really like it too, because he just started to get into sushi like a couple of years ago. He never would eat it before. Uh, and I think this is like a little bit different and I really think that he'll like it He's he's also starting to like the cauliflower crumbles. Just saying guys look what I just ordered on Etsy It's a little like keychain that you can put your Aldi quarter in so you can always use the same quarter I looked up a bunch of them here on Etsy because they had a, they had a lot of different ones but I ended up going with this um, shop because she had like a sparkly one so I got a sparkly background and then I got I think I got black letters here and then this is gonna be hot pink no 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 this is gonna be purple excuse me and then this embroidery here and this little button I asked to be aqua and it was only five bucks and then like two dollars shipping so I'm really excited for this I know it's like I don't know so basic but you know what I just love it another shop had this design here uh, which I like this a I'm weird about fonts like I love fonts this one was 650 and then it was like three dollars shipping or something like that but I don't know they have a ton of different ones on Etsy I will link the one that I got below for you guys but I just thought it was so cool. I saw somebody, like a, a blogger wrote about it and uh, somebody tagged me in it on Facebook and then I actually shared it on Facebook and ended up getting one because I mean, I don't wanna keep searching for a quarter all the time in my car every time I go to Aldi so I can use the same one over and over and it's just so cute, it's such a good idea. Well, it's like hours later and I haven't vlogged for a couple of hours today but uh, Alex is home now. Say hi, babe. Hi, babe. <laughs> He's home now, and uh, I just put up my $5 beauty video. So if you haven't seen that yet, I'll link it below for you so you can watch it if you want. It's like 19 minutes long or something like that. But uh, yeah, so I just was doing all of that. I had to do all of the description box for that, make, you know, get all the links for you guys and put them there. I just hate when people don't put links. Like I'm watching a video, I was just watching a video right now, and this girl mentioned like 30 different things but didn't put links to anything 
and didn't like name anything so you have to like go back and like write down what it is I don't know I just always like to link stuff but you know how it goes people don't always do that and yes I have a I have my sports bra on right now I'm not naked <laughs> but uh yeah so I just wanted to say hi and check in because I have not been on camera for a couple of hours. I actually just left it in here. I, I haven't been in here at all. Oh, I did have somebody ask me about my ring that I had on in that video, uh, the $5 video, and it was this one. I don't know if it'll focus, but it says Expecto Patronum. So if you're a Harry Potter fan, then you know how awesome that is. I got this on Etsy, on an Etsy shop. I will link that below as well, but I always wear it on my middle finger. I just love this ring. So cute. She makes a ton of different rings too. Like you could put anything on this. Uh, my sister got one. I forgot what her said. I can't remember what her said, but I went with the Harry Potter one because I just loved it. So I'll link this Etsy shop below for you as well. This is like an Etsy day. While well, the rest of his clan is laying on the ground, Nala just wants to be rubbed. I don't know what Dad's doing. I'm just chilling right here. I'm yoging. <laughs> Me and Nala were just laying down here, then Dad came down. He, He's just, uh, he paused his game. What are you doing? Chilling. I was trying to take photos of her, but I can never get good photos of her like you can. Ever. Like, they're just not good. Right place, right time. I know, but you always get good ones. Always. And I just, she closes her eyes. She looks, she looks goofy. You're so beautiful, Nala. You're so beautiful. Uh -huh. Oh, so sweet. Give her the rubs. What do you want? She wants rubs. I'm not really sure what that was. Ugh, were you licking daddy's hand? That was kind of gross and all. What are you... Can you look at the camera and say hi? Hello. <laughs> do you really think that's how she sounds? Come on. Hey, guys. My name's hi, guys. Nala. So nice to see you. Alex went to the gym because he didn't get to work out with me this morning. So he is there now and I've just been playing with makeup. As you guys can see, I'm just messing with the Anastasia palette because I love it. And also this Carly Bible palette. <clears throat> um, and I'm drinking my magnesium, my natural calm because I just love it. And watching Shameless. So that's what I'm doing right now. And he'll be home in a little bit so he he just he said he's doing three sets of 15 he's doing arms tonight so i'm proud of him very proud of him for some reason i'm still like really nasally i have felt fine the last couple of days but i feel like at night i just get so nasally i don't know why that i was i was watching the video uh the five dollar video and i was like oh my gosh you sound so freaking nasally but it's all right, look at this. Looks like I have a black eye on my hand. So I just finished season six of Shameless and it was so good. And now I have to figure out how I'm gonna watch season seven because it's not on Netflix. Uh, I'm not sure if it's on Hulu or not. I don't have Hulu, I used to have it, but I'll see if it's on Hulu. If it's not, then I'll probably just do it through the Showtime app. But I've just been reading that the Showtime app kind of sucks, so. We'll see. I know there's like a free trial period, so I might just try it and kind of zoom through it, but I'm probably not going to do that until next week, like late next week, because I need to study as much as I can during this weekend and then the whole entire week because I have my, my next exam coming up for the real estate exam. So I need to study as much as I can. I'm not going to overdo it and overthink it because I do believe that's what happened last time like I just overthought everything but I do need to study uh the section specifically that I didn't pass in so I need to do that but I feel confident again going into it so we'll see how it all goes but that's later next week but I think right now I'm just going to go put some peace and calming essential oil on and also put it in but put it in the diffuser and then just head to bed. So we will definitely talk to you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching this tonight. Please be sure to subscribe if you haven't yet. It's crazy how close we are to 4,000. I just, I can't believe it. I just love all of you guys so, so, so much. Be sure to leave a thumbs up and a comment below and hopefully Alex will get on commenting back to everybody as well. I told him he needs to start doing that. So we will see you guys tomorrow, I love you.
Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. <laughs> and we'll see you tomorrow. Oh, love you.